Hello everyone, you are in Endurance Laser Lab. In this video I want to show you how to upgrade non-branded Chinese laser. So we have this uh, laser model, 500 milliwatts, uh, with a wavelength uh, 405 nanometers, so it's purple laser. And we want to show you how you can upgrade it at uh, air assist, air nozzle, and how you can uh, actually upgrade a laser laser driver so the thing is that these lasers they die uh, quite quickly and you, uh, probably a lot of, of you already know this problem because of the very bad uh, laser driver so he, here how it looks inside so it's uh, actually a piece of junk it's not even isolated so you have all wires and everything is like this in the metal so it can be shortened quite easily. So we recommend you, uh, if you bought a laser, especially with uh, high power, like 5 watts or 5.5, uh, uh, just to upgrade it uh, immediately, just take a laser box, uh, this one, uh, like, uh, like we show on our website. You can check endurance uh, laser box and uh, wire uh, it to your to, to the laser diode. Keep in mind that if Chinese guys say that the laser is uh, 50, uh, 15 watts, like here you have, uh, you can see they have it uh, even, uh, yeah, not here they don't have it, but on some they, they show that even 15 watts. Keep in mind that uh, it's fake. Maximum power these diodes can do is 5.5 watts and the problem is like i said with a, a low quality laser driver so you need uh, it, it'll kill your diode quite quickly so if you want to uh, add an air nozzle you need a drill uh, 3.2 millimeters and this tool for uh, four uh, millimeter so just to be able to to screw it screw it back but this can you help uh, okay, so uh, let us show you what we have at the end. So here is the laser uh, we already upgraded. So you drill a hole uh, here for your air assist, and Boris will show you how to install it. By the way, we showed a detailed video of how you can make your own uh, air nozzle. So it's open source. Uh, you just uh, check in Google Endurance. Uh, lasers air assist and you'll find out how you can make it very easily so uh, you just drill the hole inside the heat sink and uh, you just add your air nozzle uh, if you want to use an air pump here yeah, what we what we offer is Halia uh, Halia uh, 318 so it's a pretty good one okay we're ready okay yes we're ready so air assist is here so you can just uh, connect it with your Halia or any other air compressor and you have your air assist on your laser okay now buddies will show you how to wire the laser actually we, we started you see the very very weak light because the laser diode is dead so it it has uh, what is the power consumption that's uh, 4.9 volts and 0 0.3 amps so it consumes almost nothing so it's just burned and it's very easy to to solder it but can you show us what is inside how to solder it? Okay, but this will will unscrew it. Will open. Yeah, our laser box is equipped with a um, key that is very necessary to follow FDA and other uh, regulations. So keep in mind that all laser boxes they, we have uh, keys right now, and also we deliver deliver stickers. stickers like, like this uh, okay so uh, 
Yeah, so it's quite easy. So this is 12 volt uh, fan, a small one, but uh, it's 12 volt. And uh, you just need to get wires from the laser, from your diode, and solder it with a laser box uh, wires. Uh, red goes plus and black is ground, so do not miss polarity. It's very critical for all diodes, especially laser diodes. And uh, when you just removed your initial your existing uh, laser driver like this or anything else uh, you just need to wire your uh, your laser diode wires with endurance laser box wire uh, the thing is that you can also add a, a temperature sensor thermometer but the thing is that um, it doesn't have enough space to to drill it so it will not measure temperature accurately so yeah that's that's how it works like this and you see the fan uh, fan is working and uh, the bodies will, will turn on the laser you can see very very weak light so actually it's very easy to upgrade your existing Chinese non-branded uh, diet laser with our laser box and get all measurements uh, so you can check uh, voltage, you can check uh, current and voltage that goes on your diode. You can run full power like this, you can have it uh, TTL and Arduino mode. So all these switches now are open for your Chinese uh, module. So if you have any questions and you want to upgrade your Chinese laser and you have some questions, please email us to uh, gf at endurancerobots.com or text me plus 7916-225-402 and visit our website endurancelasers.com and our online store endurance-lasers.com and have a wonderful experience with endurance. Bye-bye.